What is going on guys? Welcome back to the official YouTube channel of Pagefly. Um, my name is Brendan and as usual, we are doing another Shopify store review. This is actually the last one in our series. We've been doing these for the past 12 weeks or so and um, it's time to wrap it up and hopefully you guys have got a lot of value from it. But let's just jump straight in. We've got a page here. Um, this isn't a whole store review, but it's more of a page review for this brand called Life Fuel. Um, and I wanted to run through this one because this page is actually built on Pagefly. It's a super long form landing page. And yeah, I basically just wanted to go through some of the elements that make it great. And then um, obviously give you guys a solution if you want to make similar pages um, to capture more conversions on your store. But um, let's just go ahead and get started. So the brand is Life Fuel. Um, you can see they've got their header and their header here uh, from the Shopify theme that they've kept. Kind of looks like the debut theme, but uh, I'm not sure entirely. I would need to check that. Anyway, you can see a nice hero image here um, with an actual person in it, which is great. I always recommend using a face or a actual product in your hero image instead of just a blank, um, you know, color. Uh, so we so use an actual image of a real person or a real thing. Um, and then we have this main headline, identify the essentials, forget the rest. And then another sub headline that's very benefit driven, you know, curb your cravings, boost energy, transform your health. And um, so it's all about benefits and convenience, your all in one essential shake. And then they have a nice big bright green or bright green, my goodness, bright green call to action. Um, that really pops out from the page. Um, and what I really like about this is they've used a subtle overlay, a transparent overlay um, to give the contrast or give the text a little bit more contrast against the background image. So it doesn't just kind of um, blur into obscurity. So that's a really nice touch. Um, and then obviously the green button is really good use of the isolation effect, but we'll talk about that later. And then going down, we've got some really nice images and multiple headlines. So whenever you can use an image, uh, just use them because an image can speak a thousand words and you don't really need to talk too much about how um, fresh and healthy these ingredients are because the images do that for you, you know? Um, so anything that can be explained with an image, it's better to use that rather than write out a big wall of text. So this is very simple, super food, super fuel. You've got the benefits and then you've got the um, kind of like the compounds or the nutritional information of these uh, superfoods. And then we have more headlines, uh, which is great for landing pages. You wanna have multiple headlines to keep people engaged and keep them scrolling. Um, and you wanna break up your sections. You know, you don't wanna have big massive walls of text because that's just gonna put people off. People are really intimidated by big walls of text. So try and avoid that. They've done a great job here and everything's really congruent like the heading colors um, and even these little graphic bullet points, uh, it's all it's all congruent. The brand colors uh, all fall in line, which actually strengthens the branding a lot. And then <clears throat> moving further down, again, an image that speaks more than words can. You don't really need to know what's in this um, this bowl because, uh, well, you can see um, a nutritionally complete meal. Again, more headlines and then another call to action. So you probably notice that the trend here is that this bright green only appears when an action needs to be taken. And um, so this is the isolation effect. I talk about this in my other videos and it's a whole concept of only using a color whenever you want someone to take an action. So it's the only time on the page you'll ever see it. And that really just helps like draw the eye to it because you wanna lead your prospect by the hand and make it as easy as possible for them to take action. Use the isolation effect, as long as the color is not too crazy and it still fits in with the theme of your brand. Um, and green works perfectly here. Green and orange are great colors generally uh, to use for call to actions. And here we have a little slideshow. So these are just testimonials from happy customers. Uh, you can actually drag and drop this exact element onto your page if you're using Pagefly. It's super easy, then you just type in the content yourself. Um, again, nice little GIF graphic here. So this is a really good use of like data to actually make a statement here. 
of Americans failed to meet the daily requirement for one or more essential nutrients. So it's kind of like a fear-based approach, but also educating the reader. Um, and you need to educate your readers if you're trying to sell something in the wellness niche. It's super important. You need to educate your prospects in general, but you know more so when you're in the wellness niche and people are trying to like make body transformations and get on top of their health. And then again, another bright green call to action. So in your landing page, you want to have multiple call to actions, but for the same offer. Now you don't want to have multiple calls to action all leading to different offers. You want to have multiple calls to action all leading to the same offer. So they've got multiple points of, um, you know, being able to take further, take the next step into the funnel. Here we have some custom graphics, which I'm a big fan of as well. This kind of just breaks the norm. It's a bit of a pattern interrupt and it is super easy to just scan and get the gist of what these products are about. You know, um, they're natural, they're wholesome, they're healthy and they're going to benefit you. And then we have the actual product here. So this is just a simple product element that you drag and drop onto your page. You can also do this within the PageFly dashboard. It's super easy. And then again, that green call to action. So this is great to see. And they've got the little promo here. Buy one, get one free BOGO Essentials. Drop down menu with the different flavors. And then frequently asked questions. Now, if you're making a landing page, you really need to have these. And Life Fuel have gone for this accordion element that expands. And this is really, really good for conversions. And the main reason is people don't have to navigate away from your page to get the information they need. So they can stay on the page, they can read all about it, they can um, kind of address any fears or concerns they might have by clicking through all of these. And then when they're finally ready to order, just scroll back up and click order. So you don't want these to link to a different page because the whole idea is that if you make them navigate away, they're less likely to come back. You know, So you wanna keep them on the page at all costs to get that conversion. And then at the very end, you know, we've got a, just a closing statement and your footer, some basic stuff, you know, join the family, sign up to their email list. And that is essentially it. Um, this is a really great landing page. And I wanted to run through it because it's made with our app, PageFly. And it just shows you the potential of what you can do if you've got, um, you know, a niche or a product that you're really proud of. And you've got great images and you've got great copy. Like this was more than likely uh, written by a professional copywriter. It's very well done with the headlines. The branding is on point. So yeah, if anyone's in the wellness niche, this is definitely one to to look to. I'll leave the link in the description, lifefuel.com. Um, you can look at this, get inspiration, try and emulate it. Um, you know, if you're selling supplements or anything in wellness. And that's essentially it, guys. Don't forget to use multiple headings, use benefits, use the isolation effect and use really strong images and yeah multiple calls to action so that's all for today's video this is the last shopify store review and um, we might do some more in the future but we've got some more content planned for the new year um, and of course as always if you want to try pagefly you can get it for 14 days on a free trial uh, on the premium plan you can try out all the features build yourself a landing page like this test it See if it converts and uh, you'll make your money back in no time and you won't have even spent a penny yet. So um, that is really all I have to say. I will see you next year and uh, Merry Christmas and enjoy the holidays, guys.